Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4 Part 102 and we're going to be driving a race car in this segment specifically this BMW M3 GT2 art car because it's fucking cool I like this livery a lot it's nice anyways I'm actually not going to do anything as far as upgrading which means basically for a race car just remo removing restrictors so I'm just going to do the stock for the BMW race car showcase. It's limited. It's open to any BMW, but it shows off race cars, as you see. So, and then Russo in the fucking Z4 GT3. Because why the fuck not? So we got four races to do, and three Grand Prix circuits, and then one not real circuit. So, cool. Two laps around all track. Let's start at Hockenheim. Okay, so the only reason why I haven't won this race yet, um, is because I've been driving way, way too poorly. Way too poorly. Maybe if I stop driving like absolute garbage trash shit, I'd be able to win this not actually that difficult race. Although I did get my worst launch out of all, like, five of these attempts so far. Can you fuck off, whoever that is? I think that's Esposito. And that freaking that older B Bimmer. God, that was awful. Okay, we've got three got two guys diving up my inside. Honestly, should have seen that coming. Now I'm going to do this. So I'll get back around them. Meanwhile, Muller and Rossi are just driving away. Despite my best efforts to not allow Rossi and or Muller to just pull out a five-year lead, they always do without fail every single fucking time, no matter what I do. It's really goddamn annoying. Yeah, I saw Shane's shooting star press. Did better than the Lesnar. Ha 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 ha. Anyways. Try to catch these two fuckers and maybe pass them. Though with our performance difference, they most likely will not be clean passes. Because, you know, they have lifted restrictors because, hey, upgraded opponents. I'm driving this bitch bone stock, because hey, I'm a masochist. Okay, I don't have to worry about anybody diving underneath me this time, thank god. Speaking of, Miller diving underneath Rossi. fucking tight. More. Careful where you're pointing your car. Fucker. There's a pile of bimmers. I like how there's three art cars in this race, thanks to me entering one as well. So much artsy fartsy fuck. Okay, this took way, way too many tries, but I'm finally going to get the win here. Christ, that was more annoying than it had any right being. Also, uh-oh, that last upshift to fourth gear, fourth gear was a flat shift. Time for everybody on the internet to get angry at me for no reason. 
I remember the start of the Forza 3 LP. People got so upset that I was flat shifting. So fucking upset. I don't know why. But, whatever. Anyways, I win. Everyone's across the line. Yada yada yada. Russo finished fifth, I think, in the, uh... His... Z3? Z3? I think? I don't fucking know. Z4 GT3, yeah. Anyways, race two. Can I please just win this fucking race already? I just want to get away from Silverstone. Fuck Silverstone. I hate Silverstone. Every fucking incarnation of Silverstone sucks giant ass. Okay, Esposito's behind me. He can go die in the biggest of fires. In fact, let me be the one to light him on fire. Because he's the biggest cunt in the history of cunts. Now. Can I actually fucking keep up with these guys and pass them? And not allow Rossi to pull out a five-year lead just out of nowhere. Moore's going for the lead. Just probably gonna allow Rossi to pull out the five year lead. Okay, sneak around Evans, that works. Swing around, swoosh around at Muller. Way too early on brakes. Oh, but I got the pass done. Somehow. Okay, now I have a whole lap to work on Rossi. Can I please finally catch and pass this fucking Mmm. Not a cunt, he's just a bastard. Esposito's the cunt. And he just pulls out a fucking over a second and a half out of nowhere. I swear to God, Rossi. When you're actually like the infamous in Rossi, boy, are you such a bitch to deal with. Slipstream. Stay in range. Okay, well, I stayed in range down the whole straightaway. I don't know how much it helped me, but, you know. Okay, I need to get closer to do my swoosh move. This might be close enough, I don't know. Okay, let's not fuck up this turn like last time. Hey, look, I didn't fuck it up. Fucking Christmas miracle. Holy shit, okay. This is taking far, far too many tries, and far too long. Even like after removing restrictors, this is a pain in the goddamn dick ass fuck. There we go. Fuck Silverstone. <laughs> fuck everything about Silverstone. I hope Silverstone closes down. IRL. God damn. <sighs> Please don't let these next two races be nearly this fucking bad. Please? Alright, I'm not fucking around anymore. Maximum tired width, let's go. Restrictors off, tires as wide as possible. Let's fucking do this shit, god fucking damn it. Oh, can I 
clear Johansson. Yes, I can. Okay. Now into the first turn. Congestion, as does every Nurburg first turn. Who thought Screws put every, uh, whatever artist painted this car? That's who thought Screws put every color on this Bimmer. It's called an art car for a reason. It's like they had an artist do a special painted livery. Hey, look who's fucked his way up to almost second. Bane of my existence. Anyways, I don't care that I crashed my way to the lead. Holy god damn. I mean, I did slow down a little too much, but Jesus fucking Christ. It has been absolutely fucking relentless. I forgot how insane the AI was in these race cars. It's like they turned the aggressiveness up to 15,000. When we're in actual, like, race cars. It's fucking insane. Just, holy shit. Also, goddamn, I, f I keep forgetting how bumpy this track is. Until I see the fucking needle just go up and back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Okay. Survive lap one. This was technically my second attempt. I, always, I also always forget that the finish line in this game is at pit exit, for whatever reason. I have still no idea why Turn 10 put the line there, but they did, so whatever. around here without getting fucking dumped all right I think I got this now just gotta keep my car on the road all should be fine. Ooh. Is desperately trying to get grip over these bumps. My ultra thick tires now. Nice and smooth through the chicane. Okay. Oh, I. I Owe it all to the friggin' the f being on the inside in turn one, therefore being able to crash my way into the lead. And also the thicker tires contributing to just making this race not completely fucking unbearable. So there we go, Nurburgring. I win, yay. I just realized my PI 798, damn. I almost have this thing at the, I have this thing at the top of R3 class now. Anyways, one race to go, so let's go to it and fuck. Can I somehow, through some sort of miracle, first attempt victory at here at the Alps? Please. Please. I want to move on. Make more progress. Well, this first turn is not promising, because hey, I'm stuck behind Esposito.
Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? You stay behind me, you bitch. I said stay behind me, fucking waste of space. Just gotta call Esposito every insult I can think of, which in reality isn't many. It's usually whatever swear word I can think of at that moment in time. Oh god, argy bargy everywhere. Give me room. Jesus. I'll crash my way onto the podium. Hi guys. Please let me pass you. <laughs> I'm actually having like an enjoyable drive this time. Actually suffering through these, this race, hi Rossi. Okay, I can kind of afford to be a little patient with this pass, but you know what? Fuck that. <laughs> Opportunity rose. I took it. Slow down enough. It's okay, everything's fine. Nothing is fine, it didn't slow down enough again. Holy shit. I don't know what that 9.7 on the, uh, on the display here is. What does it mean? Seriously, I want to know what does it mean? Okay, one more turn, no pressure from behind. So it went very, very uh, quickly through there. Through the S's. Hey, I first tried the Alps, thank god. Alright. Well, this entire series was fucking awful. Uh, but I finally made it. So, gotta remember, once we get to the, uh, the race cars, AI will do anything and everything they can to fuck your shit up. Noted. Duly noted. But there we go. BMW GT race car showcase complete. I'm just going to go to the upgrade shop real quick and show what I did to the car. That. And also, not that, but full tire width. So, hooray. Both front and back. So there we go. That'll conclude this segment, so with that, stay tuned for more Forza Motorsport 4, and hopefully some more successful racing and less frustration from me. So, ah. Uh.